Yo, it is Terrell, Hall of Fame D-Line, and uh, these are Bully Rats. Uh, I've been answering the questions, and I understand what a lot of y'all are saying is that I do have a lot of opinions about what should go on in the ring. I consider to look at them as facts, considering it's written in the rule book. But uh, what would I do differently? And I did one similar to this, but hey, we can revisit it. One of the main things I would do differently as we start talking about a registry and how to how to properly get the judges in order is in every business you have you know somebody who comes in and drops the hammer your uh, quality control officer and a lot of the complaints with uh, the show scene lately has been not only the judging but sometimes the uh, environment and the way it's maintained at these shows. I mean, you know, as a company as large as some of these companies are, and registries are companies, they're worldwide, you know, throwing shows in different uh, countries and doing a lot of different things. I don't understand why there is not a quality control officer. And this person's whole job is just to go around and make sure that things are done in a proper fashion. Of course, he's not going to judge the show, but if he sees or she sees that the show environment is not proper, if there's things there that they don't like, things that's being allowed, maybe it's weed smoke, maybe it's this, maybe it's that, and they don't feel that that's conducive to a professional environment, then that show host can be, you know, suspended or, you know, fined or whatever, but, you know, they'll know next time that there's a certain things that we must do here. And it's the same thing that goes with the judges. We've had a lot of controversy on some of the judges' picks, and a lot of them have been very, very, very much across the line. Uh, a judge should be the same way. You should face suspension. You know, if you if you become a habitual offender to the rules that we are asking you to follow, then you know your ability to judge a show should be taken away from you. But without these rules in place, we're going to continue to see what we see. A lot of different things that I understand why people feel uncomfortable with what they're seeing and uncomfortable with the dogs that they're seeing, and it's always going to be a controversy until somebody is there to lay the law down. You know, it's it's got to be an understanding that these dogs, when you do pick a dog for a first place ribbon, it is for a championship stock. This is supposed to be your best of your best. Right now, these things are being handed out like Skittles. And it needs to be an officer to address that. That if, you know, if you can withhold a ribbon, you know, if the show scene is not good, we'll fix it. And I've went over that, but over and over again, anything that's wrong, it needs to be somebody that's pulling in the reins here to make this thing a better environment. I personally am not rooting against anybody, as I said uh, on, a, uh, on a previous uh, video. I'm actually rooting for them. But things will not get better in this community until we have somebody who is willing to enforce rules and make sure that the breed is getting the best of what it's supposed to get. And that's my opinion on that. See y'all in the next one. Peace.